So, check and prepare presentations, outline papers, write introductions, give you potential answers to lots of random questions, and translate languages. But one of the coolest things I found that it can do is help you write code. Now, I have no shame in admitting that I am not a full-time programmer. Those guys are on a completely different level than me. I have enormous respect for those guys. I could never do what they do. But I do know enough code to make my own video games as an indie dev. Anyway, I consider myself more of an intermediate level programmer, so by no means am I a master, but I do know enough to be dangerous. And I really feel like as an intermediate level programmer, ChatGPT has been a complete game changer for me as an indie developer. For example, I might not be a coding genius, but I'm very familiar with the code that's related to 3D animation. So just to do some quick tests as to how reliable the code from chat really is, I figured I'd ask it how to do some simple stuff that I already know how to do. So I asked it, what would the C-sharp Unity 3D code look like if I wanted to rotate and spin an object on the Y-axis at a speed of 0.5 every frame? And to my surprise, it gave me this. And I recognize this code. I spin things all the time in all my games. Spinning is my favorite and I use this code a lot. This is in fact real code to control rotation in Unity. If I copy and paste this line straight into the game, you will see it does exactly what I asked it to do. And it even tells us that we should probably be using time.delta time. How cool is that? And if we try again and ask it to tell me how to make an object move to a position of negative 41x, 1y, and negative 6z, wait for it to give us the code, and plug it in, again, it actually works. Now, obviously, these are small examples, and the bigger and more complicated your coding project is, the less likely it will be to accurately succeed in giving you what you want without errors. But as far as programming tools go, I think its best use is in giving you small specific chunks of code that you might need or forgot. But it's not limited to small one-liners. For example, if I ask it to write the code for me that creates a list variable named database that contains 10 integer values and in the update method organizes that list from greatest to least in Unity using C Sharp, it will give me multiple solutions. I personally prefer this one because I'm more familiar with the link system, so I'm gonna grab this, dump it in, and look at that. It has organized my list from greatest to least exactly the way I asked, which is crazy because the most frustrating part of being a beginner or intermediate level programmer like myself is when you're stuck before you only really had two options which was go to a programming discord or go to the unity forums and make a thread for your question and pray to god that somebody would answer you tomorrow but now there's a third option you could ask chat gpt today and maybe get your answer immediately and unlike all the subjective bullshit you have to worry about when you ask chat questions about life and stuff when you're working with code you instantly know whether what it tells you is true or false right away and if it gives you the wrong answer you can give it a thumbs down and tell it the right answer to help it learn from its mistakes which in turn will help all the rest of us i am personally really excited to use chat as a tool to help me learn unreal 5 as soon as i'm done making my character so hope that helps and as always hope you have a fantastic day and i'll see you around